how's it going? Welcome back to another episode of my North Face um, jacket reviews. Today, I bought one of my favorite jackets right now. It's called the uh, North Face Summer Series L3 Goose Down Jacket. This is super lightweight, but yet super warm. So. Here it is. I got it in black. This is a small. Oh, it looks fully zipped. Front view. Side view. Back. Other side. So this has the traditional North Face logo on the left chest area. Another logo with the Summit series on the left arm. You got this zipper. You got this cinch cord on the inside of the pockets. The hood, you can see. It's naturally. cinched so you can see that it's already covering my hat without me pulling any strings so it has a natural elastic so it creates this bubble looking back so also here has the 800 goose down feel so that's why it's super warm also comes with these uh, sleeves here the elastic sleeves to make it more comfortable on the wrists. These are, I believe, water repellent. And this jacket is water repellent. That's kind of good. So if you're stuck when it's raining out, you're not going to get soaked because as you know, once goose gets soaked, it's going to clump up and you're going to have to quickly throw in your dryer with a couple of tennis balls just to dry it out. But So it is on a little shinier side. Um, if you're not into shininess on your jackets, I suggest um, trying to look for, I guess, the Premonition, North Face Premonition jacket. I think they do have uh, one that's not that shiny. I think it's called the Black Matte. But yes, this is something I recommend. Super warm, super lightweight. All right, so my likes and dislikes about this jacket. It's super lightweight is a plus and it's also warm. It's warmer. It's more comparable to my cryos, which I'll show you in another video, but the cryos is also a super heavy expedition parka jacket. And this is comparable to it in my opinion. So I mean if you want I mean eight hundred down feel you can't go wrong because that's the highest I've seen so far right now with the uh, goose downs at eight hundred. Um, let's see, and then this right here when it's zipped up, it's kind of like a face mask here. So that's kind of good for when it's a windy, cold, cold night, right? So you have a natural face mask here. Uh, drawbacks about the jacket, and it's a, is there's not too many pockets. There's only two, one on the left side, one on the right side. There's no pockets inside. And the next thing is when you unzip this jacket, you got these two collars here popping out, almost like vampire uh, capes. But it's cool. It's more for warmth rather than, um, I guess, looks wise. But if you're into that look, I mean, that's cool too. I don't mind it at all. I think it's a great addition to my winter uh, jackets. All in all, I think it's a great buy. I believe it's $350 USD. And right now the fit, this is a small, I feel like I can still wear another jacket, maybe a Denali, and it'll be even warmer. But I think I might be over, uh, be too hot. Um, and this can go below, I guess, um, 30 degrees below. Fahrenheit. You can 
once again, let me know if you have any questions and I'll try my best to answer.